just glad that there's still a voice that represents us, the youth, the culture, the generation, still on the mainstream. So it's always great to, it's always good to keep on working. So I'm, I'm, I'm literally sitting here cracking up and thinking to myself, uh, first of all, my face is a little red because I was emotional about something, something good. But anyway, so because I'm on the other side of it, right, and you guys follow like these celebrities and people, um, and I know that people talk about us because of the show, who would date, you know, whatever is happening in our lives. But it's always interesting for me, and I talked about this recently, for me to read the stuff about myself that are just false, you know? Um, oh my God, this person was best friends with that person. How dare they? Guys, stop making this shit up, okay? I, and it's, it's everything that you read online, a lot of it is bullshit, you know? I don't mind, like I live in my truth. I say what it is, but some of this stuff is crazy to read. My message got cut off. Anyway, the point is, is that... um. Yeah, you know, take the stuff you read uh, with a grain of salt, you know, and really think about you as a person, right? When you read things and you're passionate about it or you really believe it, you're saying, oh, okay, let me go to that person's page to really tell them about themselves. But a lot of the stuff that you see is really bullshit. You know, if I was in a photo with somebody 10, 15 years ago, whatever it is, it doesn't mean we were friends. It doesn't mean we were best friends. It doesn't mean that we dated. Um, you could be in a photo with somebody or you could share space with somebody and it not be what people make it out to be. You know, and a lot of people believe this. So it's so interesting to me. Um, anyway, life is good. You know, um, we're good. I'm happy. Um, but yeah, just needed to share that because I'm always like, what the hell?